Joe Kaczynski's goal for this movie, and he told us, Peter and I, this a long time ago, was to shoot as much of the movie in camera as possible. We're on a set right now at the Sky Tower that exists 2,000 feet above the Earth's surface. Typically, the easiest thing to do would be to shoot that with a blue screen visual effect. But Joe didn't want to wait and, and, and wait for visual effect shots to come in. So he conceived an idea where he would put camera mounted up on a volcano in Maui and have film be shot for two weeks so that he would have footage that he could play all around us. So in that sky tower, you have uh, live footage of clouds rolling in, sunsets, storms that exist in this environment so that when you shoot it in camera, it's there. When Tom Cruise walks outside to get in his bubble ship, he is surrounded by moving clouds, uh, moving thunderstorms, sun rising, and it really is, it is a, it is, it, it really is an ingenious technique. I've never seen a set quite like this. This again is Joe's his detailed eye, his architecture eye. Um, it is a very clean um, aesthetic that is both relatable yet fantastical. It's an environment that looks futuristic, but it you know it has things of our world. Um, and then when you pull out to see where it is, you're 2,000 feet in the sky, which is just a mind blower. He's designed a pool with a glass bottom that will have thunder clouds rolling beneath them, which is you know. Just great to, just the idea of that alone is amazing. I think when people see the, the visuals of this film, they're going to see things that feel epic in size and scope, uh, that will feel mythic, like all good sci-fi. Um, and then they'll start to see materials of Jack's journey, which is going to be um, very mysterious. Um, the, the basic through line, though, is, is a simple one, and one I think audiences will grasp. It is about a man defending his home um, and protecting the woman he loves.